it's really fun to get to talk to students and t tell them about what you've learned in your experiences as a musician, and everybody has a different path. We think about everything in terms of the kind of career path we've taken, where we're the artist out there playing, but what kind of information could we give to somebody um, even to say, hey, maybe you don't need to do what we did. There's a lot of different ways to have a great career in music. And everything that they learn um, here could, could also, aside from the artistic stuff, could, could also set them up to be music teachers, um, producers, agents, managers. On the banjo over here, we have Abigail Washburn, and she is a, she's a folk musician. She's also a Chinese speaker. And uh, Bela has had many different products over the years, from bluegrass to uh, classical to jazz. I mean, I'm always thinking about how to be excellent at what I do, but there isn't, there isn't really a standard of excellence. I think a basic disposition of gratitude to every opportunity that comes your way and, and a, a willingness also to work hard for opportunity is a wonderful balance in a person who wants to be a musician and have a career as a musician. Be a really wonderful person full of gratitude and a lot of people are going to want to work with you. So I will also encourage you as you're playing with the different musicians, we got to see some great ensembles the other day, not only figure out what you do that's special, figure out what the people in the group do that's special and how you can attach to those special things. Flight tones, it didn't all have to be about me. In fact, I like being around great musicians and pushing them forward. And then everybody goes, wow, you're so humble. And I go, yes, I'm so <laughs> humble. I think when you make music, you try to make it sound complete. In a duo, um, you get to um, do a lot. Every note everybody plays is very, very important. He's <laughs> really good at playing the banjo. And, um, That's kind of what I do. Yeah. <laughs> and she's really good at singing and playing the banjo, mm -hmm. which is not what I do. Come on, you call my nerves, wherever you may be, and listen to a story that I write to thee. My name is not the next street. The truth you will tell. I am a coal miner's wife. I'm sure I wish you well. The X factor for you is your ability to communicate with people. Like when I first met you and you were singing songs, and I wasn't even all that into it, you were singing songs, and all the girls at the party were gathered around you and they were all like crying. And There's a lot of aspects of a music career that are served by different kinds of excellence, including wanting to communicate with an audience. And it's not all necessarily a level of virtuosity or technical skill that will, that will help you excel. There's a sense of, um, of, uh, of excitement and hope within the students uh, of this is it, this is the launching pad, this is the final launching pad, that's what it feels like here, like after this we are out there. Trying to be true to yourself, trying to um, create music that has meaning for you and, um, and find a way to succeed and make a living doing it is actually a dream that I think everybody shares uh, at campus.